What if you could turn any Minecraft block into a 3D print? Well, that's what I spent all last week doing. Hello, my name is Trevor, and I'm on a journey to design 52 3D print projects in 2025. Last week, I designed kitchen upgrades with my 3D printer. But today, we're totally shifting gears, bringing Minecraft blocks to life with a 3D printer. Now, you may be asking yourself, wait a second, Minecraft blocks are already 3D, why don't you just print the block? Well, you're right, Minecraft blocks are 3D, but if you remove the colored 2D texture, they're just simple cubes. And you could print that cube and paint the texture on, but that seems tedious, and I'm not that talented of a painter. So instead, I wanted something that looks like Minecraft straight off the build plate, printed in one color, meaning each face needed to be 3D with a blocky texture. To do this, I plan to subdivide a 2D square plane into a checkerboard grid and use the luminosity value of each pixel to determine the extrusion height of each subdivision. Now that was a mouthful, all I'm really saying is that the dark spots of the block are going to be extruded out and the light parts of the block are going to be extruded less. With a plan in place, the last thing we need to do is choose our Minecraft blocks. And when I made these Minecraft blocks, it was the week of Halloween, so I decided my first block would be a Minecraft cauldron, which is kind of a spooky block. I took each face of this block and created a 3D texture and then stitched them all together to create our final 3D model. I also added these mist makers for added Halloween flair. But I think the second block I made turned out way better. And what was that block? For round two, I created a TNT block. It has steeper overhangs, so I decided to print each face flat on the build plate and assemble it around a cube afterwards. I did end up painting this one, but I only had to do two colors, red and black, which would have looked weird if it was just a flat cube. Anyways, let me know what block you would make in the comments, and you may see it in a future video. Anyways, until next time, good luck with your own projects, and thanks for watching.